Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Thomas Buck Reed was born in Danville, Kentucky. As a young man, he attended the Presbyterian Church in Danville with his nephew, James Gillespie Burney, and together they listened to the anti-slavery preachings of the Reverend David Rice. Reed then attended Princeton College and returned to Lexington, Kentucky to practice law. He married Polly Richardson in 1809. Thomas and Polly moved to Natchez, Mississippi, where Thomas became a successful lawyer and was involved in local politics. He bought a house in Natchez, which he called Reedland. The house is now known as Linden. He was a member of the Mississippi Colonization Society and was later elected Attorney General of Mississippi. He was appointed to the United States Senate by the Mississippi Legislature. In 1828, he married Margaret Allison, the daughter of Isaac Ross, owner of Prospect Hill Plantations. Senator Reed died on this date in 1829 in Lexington, Kentucky, on his way to attend a session of the Senate. His nephew, James Gillespie Burney, went on to become the leading abolitionist of the early 19th century, who ran for president on the anti-slavery Liberty Party ticket in 1840 and 1844, and he helped start the Republican Party. After her father died in 1836, Margaret Reed started the process to resettle all the Reed and Ross slaves to Liberia. I am Angus Reed, great, great, great grandson of Senator Thomas Buck Reed. I'm here at the site of the old Baptist burying ground in Lexington, Kentucky where Senator Reed was buried 187 years ago. And this has been your Natchez History Minute.